day, my muddy waters wannabe. Hey, sirs, how's everything on Earth? How would we know? We've been subterranean for 93 days. We're as abstracted from reality as you are. Maybe more. Gee, don't say hi. Well, is it time for the invention exchange? Is it time for the invention exchange? Yes. Show us what you've got, pink boy. Well, you know how it is on Earth when, um, you know, they have those giant enclosed stadiums and you can't smoke in it. And I always thought it was kind of peculiar because you can drive giant hell-belching monster trucks, but you can't smoke, right? Yeah. 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 Right. Well, so I invented this thing. It's a thing for smokers, and it's a monster truck. I call it the uh, nitro-burning funny pipe, okay? And I just start it up here, okay? And then I uh, light a match here. Ow! Yeah. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. We'll see Joel's lungs turn into a giant car. Wow, that's real gear crushing, tire popping, tobacco satisfaction. Oh, yes, uh, very nice, although we don't smoke. Well, here's ours, Jolly Ace. As you know, face masks throughout history left the bank robber, or thug, completely expressionless. Well, we've taken care of that. Larry? We've invented a stocking mask of the future with articulated eyebrows. <laughs> yes, no longer will a desperate criminal go misunderstood. The SM of F takes care of that completely. Uh, the demo, Larry? All right, put $10,000 in the bag. I'm Mark Bill, right now. Hey, ladies. Oh, oh, it works. Cool. All right, see, if you touch that alarm button, I'm going to have to rip off your fingers, and you're going to have to reattach to the nearest hospital with laser surgery. It's really cool they do that. Larry. Oh, sorry. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking that I use six bullets or only five. See all the excitement? I don't know myself. <laughs> it's all in a movie. It's really good. Clinton. Uh, <laughs> yes. Well, uh, that's our experiment this week, Joe. Come in, Joel, my little free-floating vacuum monkey. Hey, sirs, what's up? Well, not my hair. It's limp and lifeless. I don't know what to do. Just get out of the invention exchange. Stop looking at me! Uh, yes, uh, what have you got for us, Joel Arini? Well, sirs, the things that I've been working on is this new way of teleporting food. In the future, they're not going to have drive-through windows anymore. They'll have drive-by windows. You just drive your car, car by, and they teleport the food right into your stomach using something like this. Okay, I put this on. Look at an ordinary cookie. And, whoa, delicious, mm-mm. Now here, we'll try it with a glass of milk. This is the big Slurpee size. Hey. It went down. Mm-mm, teleportation. What do you think, sirs? Oh, very nice, Jolly Cakes. Uh, Larry, make a note to call James Doohan. Oh, here's our new development, an entirely new concept in oral hygiene. Yes, we've employed some of Hollywood's top stars to help us with our new mouth-to-mouth -to -mouth celebrity toothpaste. Feel the cleaning power of the star's internal juices as they go to work on plaque and tartar buildup in your mouth. There's Jack Nicholson from Witches of Eastwick. <laughs> Mr. Creosote from Monty Python's The Meaning of Life. Somebody get a bucket home and a throw out. And Linda Blair with real head cranking action. Your mother flosses in hell. Ah! Well, what do you think, Joe Larini? Mm -hmm. Well, I think four out of five dentists are going to recommend psychotherapy for you two. Thank you. Come in, Joel the Mole, my little frosted sponge cake. Hey, sirs, what are you wrecking today? Oh, nothing, really. We're just kind of hanging out, and, you know, it's... Larry, it's magic time. Make with the invention exchange, plebe. Well, as you know, even avid smokers can't stand the smell of a tar-belching pipe. And so I invented this, the Never Light Pipe. It's got a sophisticated uh, sprinkler system built in with a smoke detector, so anytime... Somebody oh, tries to light up. See, it puts it out for you. See, I'll try it on there. Ouch. Like that. They should never, ever be able to light up with this no thing. No more. It's not supposed to work. 
Oh. Well, what do you think, sirs? I think it's almost as clever as the Prince Albert in a can gag. <laughs> I love that gag. It's great. Better let him out. He'll suffocate. <laughs> now get ready for our part. Larry? Larry? Now, Larry and I have discovered that children adore putting things in their mouth, and they love puppets. We've combined the two, put a little spin on it. We call it Tongue Puppets. The show, Larry. Hey, everybody, it's me, Mr. Skanky. Oh, I love everybody here. Back at the and you are getting closer. Bye. I think you might win the award for the most unsanitary toy. Well, thank, oh, thank you. you That's very really much. nice. Yeah. Well oh, done. Congratulations. Absolutely. It's about nice time. Oh, brother. We well, finally uh, got one. It's about time. It's yeah. great. great. Uh, oh. oh. <laughs>